What's taking him so long? Something must be wrong. I think I saw him with Officer Arnold. Evening, Jack. Glad you could join the freak show. How's it looking, Henry? I don't like this one bit, Jack. Check the alley on the right. Victor Holt's over there in the shadows. He's waiting for you. Can we trust him? Nope, but we've got you covered. You better take it slowly, though. They're a bit twitchy. We want Walters. Don't try anything and nobody will get hurt. Die, you pathetic bastard! It's an old stove. It's too dark to be sure, but that rotting smell tells me these shelves are used for storing food. Watch him on the stairs. It's locked. The front door has been barricaded with tables and chairs. Get it. Empty ammo boxes and spent shoes. Nothing used. An old wardrobe. Don't shoot. I'm unarmed. Ah. We've been expecting you, Mr. Walt. Damn. He recognized me. And the key. Good coming hand. He's dead. Looks like a... Bad case of lead poisoning. Damn. He recognized me, and it sounded like he was going to get on the level with what's going on in this joint. Poisoning by the looks of it. Diary. This will make interesting reading. It won't open. It won't budge. It's locked. The 
key doesn't fit. It's unlocked. I don't understand. I'm in all of these photos. All of them. There must be some kind of mistake. Why would they want me here? Uh, it must be an old case. Something I've forgotten. Some screwball with a grudge, maybe. Think. I got it. Think. Another key. This should fit the door across the hall. It's unlocked. For nutcases, they seem quite literate. These books are really old, and most of them are in strange languages I don't understand. It appears to be a private study area. The drawer holds an ancient... I don't have time to read. I'm a detective, not a pen pusher. I don't have time to read. I'm a detective, not a pen pusher. It looks like an eye, but the rest of the painting has no real shape. There are definitely some strange sounds coming from this side of the room. Well, he's dead. The beam must have fallen and crushed his skull. Dead bodies, and plenty of them. Something dreadful has been going on down here. Seems like these cabinets are used for storing chemicals and medical equipment. it again. The crystal's still warm. His stomach stopped moving. His lungs have stopped ventilating. Dusty assortment of old books. Evening. Hi. The name's Jack Walters. I'm just visiting. You don't say, sir. Gilman. Charlie Gilman. I run this here hotel of an evening. Talking to this fellow is getting me nowhere, and he's man. more than a touch and crazy. For hotel if I need a room, and I'm desperate, then I'll come. It won't open. It's locked. It won't budge. It won't open. Hello again. Yeah? I'm after directions to the First National Grocery Store. And I'm busy, so stop your pestering me with questions. Chit-chatting to him's gonna get me no place fast. An old grandfather clock.
It won't budge. It won't open. It won't budge. It won't budge. Move along, outsider. Stop. You can't come down here. The police clearly don't want me snooping around. I need to be more careful. It won't open. Won't budge. A bold, brave crew and an ocean blue, and a ship that loves the blood. With a good wine piping, with a good wind piping, early. In the towel and scallions, miles. Ah, my boys, these are the joys of the noble and the brave who love a life in the tempest strife in the home of the mountain. It won't budge. When the driving rain of the hurricane puts the lights of the lighthouse out. Huh? Who's that there? Who oh, can you spare a few pennies, young mister? I can give you something for your generosity. Who are you? It won't open. <laughs> it won't open. That's the valiant shrink. No, no, we were bold and brave. And we love the fights in the wild blitz. The old drunkard knows something. I don't think it would take much to get his tongue wagging. I'm looking for Brian. Ken Riley says I know him. storage depot. It's shut. It won't budge. <laughs> 